<laughs> wow, those are big squirrels. <laughs> oh, they're huge. All right, you can have a seat right here, James. Thank you. Oh, oh, please, please, call me Big Jimmy. Okay, let's try to avoid that, but all right. Hold on, because we're about to knock your boots off. Oh, I'm wearing tennis shoes. So. Everything from the floor to the ceiling has been reimagined. We're taking Big Jimmy's Barbecue from its humble roots in Walker County, Alabama to the future of a locally owned fast casual dining. <laughs> Where's this? This is you! The future Big Jimmy's Barbecue. Oh! Oh, did y'all fix that leak by the front door? Uh, uh, Sometimes when it starts raining real hard, like coming in sideways, it gets up underneath that eave right there. No, and then we, we didn't address the structural issues of your building. This is just a rendering of what the inside of your restaurant could look like. Oh, okay. Yeah. Pretty neat, huh? I really like how all the chairs match. They do. We thought the brushed metal went really well with the reclaimed barn wood. Who lost their barn? Somebody had to. Steel. We can probably find the source of these materials if that's something that you're interested yeah, in. Yeah, definitely. Also, you need to put the paper towel rolls back in the middle of the table. I'm actually glad you brought that up because we've also created an island where customers can go get napkins, straws, even refill their own beverages. Yeah, hold on, you're gonna have to talk to Miss Janine about that. Who? Is Janine like a business partner or? Oh, we're doing this now. Yeah. We can always reschedule if she needs time. Barbecue. Hey, hey Janine, listen. Jimmy, where are you? I got two shoulders left in the back, and Cody says he can't touch the smoker. Yeah, I'm in Birmingham. Listen, you getting a new CPAP mask? No, not today. Janine, what do you think about customers refilling their own drinks? I think that's a great idea. If you want to run out of sweet tea every 15 dead gum seconds, I swear, Jimmy, I don't have the time. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's going to be a no from Miss Janine. We can always tweak this. Maybe move the island back behind the. Why don't you go ahead and show him the new logo? Great idea. Those red block letters of Big Jimmy's Barbecue worked well for you in the past, but our graphic designers have whipped up something that we think stands out a little bit more. It's simple, clean, and modern. We've actually dubbed that yellow cornbread gold. We're pretty proud of that one if you can't tell. Can you make the pig a little more realistic? Uh, sure, I can actually handle that right now. How's that? It's just a mock-up, of course. Right, we'll definitely have to soften this. Yeah, and I'm not trying to steer you away from your vision or anything, but studies have actually shown that customers don't want to see the animal that they're about to eat on the sign. Make them smile. Excuse me? I said, make the pig smile. I think we're going in opposite directions on this. Should the pig be happy we're about to eat him? <laughs> oh no, we're not eating this little guy. Oh, thank God. Oh, I get it now. Because you're serving vegan barbecue. No, no, we definitely serve pulled pork. Can you put a little chef's hat on him? Oh my God, why? You cannot have a cannibal pig on your sign. <laughs> Come on down to Big Jimmy's on Highway 5 between the Dollar Generals, now with matching chairs. <laughs>